Hello everyone, and welcome to Splendid Serendipity's DIY for a wine bottle light. Today, what you'll need are an electric drill, preferably one that plugs into the wall, a glass drill bit that's 5 16 inch or larger, an empty wine bottle that's been cleaned out, clear glass marbles, and a 15 count indoor battery operated Christmas tree light. Also, make sure you wear safety goggles and any other safety equipment that is instructed by your drill. The first step is going to be to drill the hole. After you have your glass drill bit inside the drill, take your wine bottle and begin to make a hole at the back at the base of the bottle. initially begin to drill, you're only going to want to use about one eighth of the power of the drill. You'll notice that it's very easy for the drill bit to slip until you have a hole started. Take your time, it takes me about one minute to get a hole started. As the hole begins to develop, you'll start to see white powder from the glass forming. After you have a decent amount of the powder, go ahead and wipe it off and you'll see the small hole that you've created. Now you'll continue to drill the hole and you'll want to continue using very little speed on the drill. If at any point you see the bottle crack or you hear the bottle crack, immediately stop and get a new bottle. The process of drilling the hole took about 20 minutes. During the video, when you see the screen go black and white, That'll be us fast forwarding it so you can see how the project continues. Continue taking your time, every now and then removing the white dust and checking your hole size. Don't be discouraged that it takes a long time. 20 minutes is about average. Continue checking your hole size and drilling and removing the white powder until your hole is complete. Now you can see that there's a small hole that has penetrated the glass. At this point you can begin to use a little faster speed with the drill, but you still want to be very careful and go no further than about half speed. As the hole gets larger, 
you'll notice that the glass bottle and the drill will be shaking. This is fine, just continue to use a slow speed. As you're continuing to drill, you don't want to drill until the bit goes all the way through. You just want a hole that is large enough to start getting the Christmas tree lights through. Once you've reached the final point where your hole looks like this and is large enough, you'll go ahead and begin to feed the Christmas tree lights through the hole. Make sure it's untangled, take the top end, and begin to feed a couple of the lights through. After you've fed about five to eight of the lights through, turn your bottle down, upside down and begin to shake it so you can try and grab the first light you put in and pull it through the top of the bottle. If you're unable to get your finger in and slide it out, you may want to use tweezers to pull it. Once you grab the first light, pull it through, and begin to bring the other lights you'd push through the bottom hole out through the top. As you can see, we have about four of the lights through. Once you have some of the lights through, begin taking marbles and put them through the top and fill it until they reach the bottom hole that you were feeding the lights through. Once you have these marbles in the base, then continue and pull up the rest of the lights, put them through the hole and pull them up. After all of the lights have been pulled through, except for one, begin putting in more marbles. You'll continue to put marbles in and then push more lights down, put marbles in, push more lights down. After we fill the bottle about halfway through with the marbles, we push the majority of the lights back in. After the majority of the lights are back in, leave one light out and put the rest of your marbles in. After you have your last of the marbles in, take the one light that's remaining on the outside and push it in the top. Now just put in your batteries, turn on your light, and set it wherever you'd like in your house.